Hello guys, this is Aaron Jones coming to you on my Red Lines account. Alright everybody, we are going to do some Netflixing. Netflixing. So I'm going to head over to Netflix.ca, I live in Canada. So I'm going to head over there. Okay, this is what Netflix.ca looks like. few things. I'm going to look up a video that is not on here called Rubber. That is not on Netflix.ca. So, the reason why I'm doing that is I'm uh, going to show you that if I exit out of here and I activate my Netflix VPN that I purchased, it is a VPN that goes down to the states and gets a state's IP address. And I go back to Netflix.com. It loads Netflix.com. And if I go to Rubber, there it is. So, <clears throat> interesting. You don't, you don't get all the movies on this, on Netflix.com, that you do on Netflix.ca, which I thought was strange. This isn't full-blown U.S. Netflix, but it does have a lot more shows and a lot more recent ones, too. Um, Star Trek came out not too long ago. Actually, it's 2009. <laughs> Anyways. So, a lot, lot more shows. A lot, lot more shows. And a lot more content, a lot more documentaries. So, what happens is, I live in Canada. I'm paying under a Canadian bank account uh, with a Canadian credit card. All I did was buy a VPN. It was like 70 bucks for the year or something. And I'm getting a US IP. So everything's Canadian except for my IP. And it gives me a whole bunch more um, movies and documentaries and stuff to watch on Netflix. And if I disconnect and close the browser, reopen, and go to Netflix.ca. Type in rubber, cannot find it. If I go to Netflix.com, not VPN, and I type in rubber, it doesn't find it. So that's proof that it works. Anyway, so if you're looking to um, get Netflix US and you don't have a US bank account or a credit card or anything like that, you can unlock more videos, a lot more videos. So just get a VPN, get a US IP, and you're good to go. Be sure to check out my other videos. Um, I have a couple of YouTube channels, so check them out. Tell me if you like them.